What is going on guys, it's Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to transform your Windows 7 to an Alienware. Now, for this you'll need one download, or two downloads, you'll need WinRAR, and you'll need a transformation pack. And this is the transformation pack right here, and this is why you'll need WinRAR. So, there'll be a link to a video in the description which will show you how to download WinRAR. And once you have that, download the transformation pack. Now... Once you have the transformation pack, find where you download it, right click, click WinRAR, and click Extract here. Now a folder should appear. And if you're wondering the theme right now, I am actually using a Windows 7 laptop, but I have got a Mac OS X Lion theme on. If you want to know how to make your laptop or computer that's running on Windows 7, Windows XP, or Windows Vista to look like this, there will be a link to a video in the description which will show you how to do that. And so, yeah, once you have this folder, you just want to open that up, and you'll see four things there. Uh, so, the two in the center are the ones, well, they're supposed to be the hardest part, but they're actually really easy. So, just open up Theme Resource Changer. Now, here, there will be something which will show you, well, basically, tell you how to do everything I'm going to show you. So it's up to you. You can either read that or you can follow my steps. So there's an X64 and X68. You need to find out what operating system your computer is on or laptop. The way you find out, you click start, you hover over computer, right click and click properties. Now it should say system type 64 bit operating system. And yeah. You might say 32 bit. If you're on 32 bit, you click x86. If you're on 64 bit like me, you'll be clicking x64. So just double click it. And the program. Okay, so I've already got it, so I don't need to install it. But yeah, just run through that really quickly and download it. Next thing you'll need is to download Universal Theme Patcher. This is what it will look like. Just double click that. Softonic enjoy software and I've also made a video how to transform your Windows 7, Windows XP or Windows Vista to Windows 8 it'll be linked to that in the description as well so when this comes up just click accept say no thanks say custom so you can uncheck this click next and it, now it will begin to download so the download is complete you just click exit which is at the bottom right now we go back to the transformation folder which is here so we have this thing here which is concave theme just open it up and again it says read me this is the place where you need to go to so you go to computer C drive windows resources then themes and I'll show you that now um, let me just exit out of yes. Oh, I was there then, but you know. Okay, so I'm just going to put this to one side and open up my computer. So you want to go to computer and click local disk, click Windows Resources, um, which is there, Themes, and here you go. Now you're probably only have about five things here I've got a few because I've downloaded themes before so you may not have as much as me but anyway you want to click this folder here well you want to click the folder and the theme here and you want to drag it into the themes folder I've already got it so I don't need to do it but it will automatically move there then do not open it yet because it will not have much effect so you want to go back to the alien transformation folder again and you want to run this theme here well run alienware theme raider and this is where everything changes and there you go alienware theme raider now, when you get it, you will not have two of them. It's just because I've downloaded it twice. 
so I'm just going to uninstall it after. But, well, uninstall one of them. So yeah, you can see it has completely changed. It looks really good. And this is white, so we'll just click off this and let everything load up properly. And you've even got a nice background. And don't know why I've got that. I'll just delete that. But yeah, you've even got the alien where background thing here. Uh, your taskbar won't be up there. Yours will be down there. And you can see when you hover, this is why you need theme patcher. When you hover over it, you do get the Alienware icon here, and it does light up blue, which looks really good. If you just take you over to documents, you can see that it does now have a black background like Alienware, and it does look really nice. Now, you can see it is fully done to Alienware standards thing. So, yeah, it's been Casual Savage here. If you have any requests on doing a tutorial how to get a software for free or how to get a theme or something then be sure to leave a comment and a like in the description and subscribe and that's it. Please subscribe, rate and peace.